An update for you now on our breaking news. Crews still there on the scene of that fire that has now torched two homes. We want to take you back out live to Karen Lair. Karen? Yeah, Donna Michelle, I spoke with the man who lives inside of the house where the fire started. He wasn't home at the time, but his wife was inside. I spoke with several teenagers who were here when it happened. They saw the flames sprung into action, climbed over a fence, were able to break into the back of the home, help the elderly woman out of the house. She suffered minor burns on her arms and her hair was singed, but her husband, who's here, says that she is going to be okay. There was nobody in the second home that caught fire afterwards, but the 10-year-old boy that lives inside told me that he's very grateful the firefighters were able to get his two cats out safely and we did speak with one of the women who saw these flames and the explosion was one of the first people to call 911 and contact the fire department here's what she had to say and my husband saw smoke I ran called 911 I ran up the road to the fire department I said oh my gosh their house is on fire I ran back as I ran back, I looked at the house and it just exploded. I'm screaming on the phone. Um, the fire department finally came um, and then the other house beside it started to get, catch on fire too. The good news here tonight is that nobody was seriously injured. We will have the latest for you tomorrow morning on Good Morning Idaho starting at 5 a.m. Reporting live in Nampa, I'm Karen Lair, 6 on your side.